This year marks the 40th anniversary of diplomatic relations between Taiwan and St. Kitts and Nevis. To celebrate, St. Kitts and Nevis's ambassador to Taiwan, Donya L. Francis, unveiled an outreach program. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang sat down with Francis to learn about the program and future collaborations between his country and Taiwan. In the world we need, we need SK Love. That's how we show from Dongyan. We show thank you so much for joining Singing Vice Versa Love by Barrington Levy is Donya Francis, the ambassador of St. Kitts and Nevis to Taiwan. To mark the 40th year of diplomatic ties between St. Kitts and Nevis and Taiwan, Francis unveiled an outreach program called St. Kitts and Nevis Sharing Kindness and Nurturing Love Outreach Program. Embassy personnel will visit and volunteer at different organizations in Taiwan to share their country's culture and history. The embassy will also hold events from June to September. This year we're celebrating 40 years of independence and also 40 years of relationship with Taiwan. And over those 40 years we've had a, um, the opportunity to share expertise in, in many areas. These include agriculture, education, and also language and culture exchanges. With this outreach program, we intend to um, visit and volunteer at different organizations and also to share our, share, um, share our culture, share our history, share our warmth and friendliness to the people in Taiwan. Francis took office in November last year. He received his bachelor's degree from Mingchuan University and a master's degree from Taipei Medical University. After receiving his degrees, he went back to St. Kitts and Nevis to work. Now he's back in Taiwan to serve as his country's ambassador. He says he looks forward to deepening bilateral ties in newer areas. Living in Taiwan six years before, I fell in love with Taiwan's um, cuisine. I fell in love with Taiwan, Taiwan people. I fell in love with Taiwan in general, the landscape and its convenience, um, especially. And so I am happy to be back, and I hope I, I, I will fall in love with more stuff uh, while I'm here as the ambassador for St. Kitts and Nevis to Taiwan. I believe that St. Kitts and Nevis and Taiwan, we have such a strong cooperation, strong, such a strong friendship that I want to encourage us um, to cooperate more in uh, um, areas that we have not seen uh, many corporations. For example, I want to see more Taiwanese businesses and investors going to Sinkis and Nevis. I want to see more trade between Sinkis and Nevis. I want to see more Sinkis and Nevis and Taiwan. I want to see more of our products here in Taiwan. <laughs> Another goal is to deepen educational exchanges. The embassy recently donated English books to the Kaohsiung Public Library. It plans to acquire more books for donation to more libraries and schools around Taiwan. In addition, Francis has also been working on creating sister schools that connect Taiwan and his country. This year began our cultural exchange with a high school back in my country, St. Kitts and Nevis, where we are focusing on um, exchange and students exchange interaction, where they are going, they are sharing their different experiences in terms of culture. Um, also, they are sharing their different approach in terms of situations that are going on in the world currently. In last time cultural exchange activity, we did a group discussion, and we talk about Taiwan's local delicacies like pig blood cake and we also discuss about some special customs about Taiwan. I think this activity is interesting because we can share our culture to them and we can also learn some difference from them. Lots of beautiful pictures of their countries and um, it lets me like really want to go there and visit it maybe go there for a month. It was a great experience because I can talk to the ambassador in a very close distance. Like Taiwan, St. Kitts and Nevis is an island nation. Francis wants to further deepen the cultural ties between his country and Taiwan, fostering greater mutual understanding and awareness. Because St. Kitts and Nevis, we are two small islands. We have St. Kitts and Nevis, St. Kitts and then Nevis. And so you can travel um, from St. Kitts to Nevis and spend a day in Nevis. You can go horseback riding, you can go to the bath, hot springs, you can visit the restaurants on the beach. You can also, in St. Kitts and Nevis, you can go to to the, um, the, skip, um, the zip line and ATV tours, anything you want to do in St. Kitts, it's right there. Snorkeling, any beach activity, 
we have it, you will have a lot of fun in St. Kitts and Nevis. Taiwan established diplomatic relations with St. Kitts and Nevis in October 1983. Francis said he looked forward to continuing this steadfast friendship in the coming years. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang and Hong Guokai in Taipei.